In recent years, we have seen that uh, climate change and extreme weather events are making a threat to mm. human beings going forward. How much do you think the recent extreme weather events are attributed to global warming and uh, these climate challenges? I think that recent developments show that the limits to growth was correct in telling that in this century, the 21st century, the human footprint would start to interfere with global limitations. And it so happens that it is the climate that proved to be the tightest constraint. We did not run out of resources, we did not run out of land, we did not run out of food, but we are actually running out of pollution absorption capacity. So we are emitting more CO2, more greenhouse gases every year than what is being absorbed by the world system. And as a consequence, the concentration of CO2 in the atmosphere is increasing. Mm -hmm. It becomes like a thicker and thicker blanket and under the blanket, it gets warmer and warmer. And that's mm. what we are now seeing. Extreme weather caused by higher temperatures caused by higher emissions of uh, CO2. Mm. And I mean, what is going to happen if this doesn't uh, stop? If it does not stop, uh, we will get warmer and warmer and warmer uh, climates. Uh, we are already now 1.2 degrees warmer than when I was born. Uh, and by the end of the century, uh, it will be twice as mm. warm as it is now.